what, what the mate is talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? We got a restaurant in downtown Dallas called Avena. Avena has a manager who took it upon himself to really disrespect a loving black family. Backstory. Family's out celebrating its mom's birthday. They're celebrating for mom's birthday. They go to Avena. The manager tells them they can't get in because they have a no tank top policy. When they point out to the manager that, well, you know, we got several women in here with us that got tank tops on, they say, well, it's for the men. You know, it's a policy for the men, not the women. So they leave and the mom take off her shirt and her and the guy switch, they switch clothes. She puts on his tank top, he puts on her shirt, which I thought was genius. They go back in, we'll try to go, but they actually enter, but the guy tell them, hey, y'all still can't come in. At this point, you know, they really have no choice but to, you know, assume that that's what it is, you know, you know what it is. You know, that little R thing in America, you know, that little racist, racism thing, you know, they, ooh, America. America give you a healthy dose of it daily. Uh, they are a bunch of uncivilized mutts who are roam the streets of America, who suck up oxygen and who rob uh, the good people of the resources that are available in America. Uh, they are really roaches that need to be exterminated. This dude could have exercised his executive power and said, okay, well, ha, okay, I see what y'all did there. All right, you know what? Since y'all were so creative with that, you know what? I'll let you come on in. They was filming dude. And he had no problem being filmed and conducting himself the way he did, which tells you he's done it before. This is his M.O., you see? So this is one of those type of situations where it is what it is, and so he did what he, he could do. You know, he had the right to refuse service or whatever, but now it's time for the family to wonder twin powers activate and go hit his ass in the pockets. That's right. Go after the restaurant. Hit him in the pockets. You know, you got COVID going on right now. You know, you got little, little you know, well, it's, it's, the, the cities are just really, really like opened all the way up and people are really getting into groove of going out again. And I'm sure they're counting the dollars right now. This would be a perfect time for a boycott. I mean, an excellent opportunity to prevent him from buying that new home or that new car he was thinking about. This is perfect. It is time. I'd say hit him in the pocket. Hit him hard. Run that online campaign and follow it up with physical presence. Yeah. Boy, cat. That's how you do it. Start with yourself. Do not go into establishments that don't appreciate your money. If I had been in that situation, I can tell you right now, fam, it wouldn't have been good for me. You know, so I already know if I would have tried to go in there, I already know every second that I was in there, 
I was just going to get angrier and angrier. And it wouldn't have turned out right for me. So at that point, once I had the evidence that I needed, I would have hit him back up on the backside with the lawyer thing and, you know, got a nice little six-figure check at the minimum off of it. Yeah, that's what I would have done. See, because they expect you to act a fool. And when you act a fool, they just call the police and then the police come and hit you with a charge and all of that stuff. But when you fight that pen with the pen, that's what they're not looking for. They don't prepare for that. They think, you black, what are you gonna do? And you just gonna get loud and most people, you know, most most will just drop it and just go on about their business. I ain't dropping nothing. Drop this paperwork on them fools. Get that money. Hit them in the pocket. Deny their children that tuition fee. Yeah. I'm denying them college, denying the cars, the home, whatever type of luxury living, or what, just, just basic living. That light bill, I mean, hit them. Hit them for the mortgage, cell phone bill. That's how you do it. Because in America, they don't respect nothing but blood and money. No more talk. What, what, what the haters talking about?